Dropshipping on eBay, it's all about converting time to money and find winning products to sell on your store. The fastest way to do it is to find other dropshippers who use same supplier like you and then get their best selling products to your store. In this video, I'm going to show you how to find dropshippers who use AliExpress and get their winning products. So sit down, relax, and let's get started. I'm Nahar Geva, your host, and I'm going to show you now how I use Zeek Analytics to find dropshippers who dropship from AliExpress to eBay. So let's get started. So first step will be to go to the product research tool and to make sure the settings set correctly. Uh, we go to the quick settings here and we just make we're on the shipping location China and the supplier settings source website AliExpress. After we change the setting, we click apply changes. We do it because uh, when dropshipping from AliExpress to eBay, the shipping location will always be China, or at least most likely will be China. Uh, and this is how we identify who is uh, drop shipping from AliExpress to eBay. This is one of the ways to identify. The next step will be to go to the product research and just type here any random keywords. For instance, I will write men watch. Now you're probably asking yourself why I use the product research tool to find competitors. So I'll show you now what is the reason and how effective it is using the product research to find a lot of dropshippers who use AliExpress. So I'll hit here the search button and I will allow uh, the Zeek Analytics product research tool to pull all the best match results under this keyword and show me who are the best sellers, what are the best selling items and who is dropshipping. So uh, for this use, I will avoid the statistics and I will scroll down to the product result. In the product result, I have the seller information. I can see their country and name, the amount of feedbacks, the amount of sales, and then the product information, pictures, titles, 30 day sales, lifetime sales, and the selling price. What I will do now, I will use new feature we added a couple of months ago, and it's the dropshippers only feature. Once I hit this dropshippers only feature, I will immediately see only dropshippers, and I will be able to identify who is dropshipping from AliExpress to eBay, who is a dropshipper and who is regular seller. The next step will be is to use the competitor research tool. So after I filter out those sellers, I can click on the scan seller button here and literally just check out every of these sellers and see who are the best ones, who are the one I want to follow. But I'm going to give you more insights on how to choose the right sellers and how do I recognize in advance which seller worth my time worth investing time in product analysis and product research. I hope you guys enjoying so far. I just wanted to let you know that we are currently running a contest on the YouTube channel. You can win one month for free on Zdeek Analytics. All you need to do is comment in the comment section below your favorite eBay niche and why. And also subscribe to the channel and smash the like button. We're going to choose one winner. Thank you very much, guys. Let's continue with the video. So already from this page, we can get some very important information that will help us make better decisions. We can see the seller country. Now, I'll give you a little secret. Every country, every community have a little bit different approach. They have different methods, different mentors. Uh, and I can say that, for example, Israeli sellers, they are very good. They work on very high profit margins and they have very good practice. Sri Lankan sellers usually work on lower profit margins and selling cheaper products. They are good to find traffic products, but sometimes uh, it's hard to find profitable products from Sri Lankan sellers. Uh, American, there is nothing specific about them. There is all kind. Vietnam is also very good. And we can see many different kinds of sellers. Lithuanian sellers, though, very good as well. They have very good methods, very good structure, and they also work on very good profit margins. So when you already know the, the meaning of every country, you can start with analyzing those sellers and then move to other sellers. Another information we get here is the feedbacks. And what I want to do is look between the ratio of feedbacks to sales. I, I'm curious to see sellers that have low amount of feedbacks but high amount of sales. Why? This means that even though they are beginners, they perform very well. So I'm going to move now and analyze these three sellers here on the top. So I'm going to analyze this guy here, the Sri Lankan, the Israeli, and then I will jump to this US seller. After clicking the scan seller button, you will see that I get in a couple of seconds the results here. So I immediately can see this seller. I can see the country, I can see his sell through rate, how many active listings he has, sold items, sell earnings, what is his revenue, his feedback score, how many successful listings out of 181 active listings and the average selling price. 
And if I like this seller, I can hit the add to watch list and save this seller to my list. Now, what I want to do now is scroll down and look for selling opportunities, right? So I'll scroll down and I look on the results here and I will try to look for products that have high amount of sales, but low amount of competition. I will usually stick to the criterias of two sales in seven days and no more than five competitors. This is if I'm beginner. If you're advanced, we will go for uh, two sales in seven days and no more than five competitors. So I will switch here to seven days. I'll hit the search button. You, by the way, can set it up automatically in your settings so it will be automatically on seven days. And then I will scroll down and I will look for product that fit my criteria. So we can look on the second product here. We have three sales in seven days, six competitors, 10 sales lifetime, and the product sell for $6.73. So what I will do next to find the product, I will just hit here the item finder button. It will automatically find the same product on AliExpress and will show me how much profit I can do. So for instance, this product selling for $6.73 and we literally can buy it for a couple of cents and make very good profit. Now, if you want to save this product to your folder, we have something called folder. You can save it to your product list and uh, you can list it later to your store. So this is how the competitor research works. This is how we find drop shippers who drop ship from AliExpress to eBay. And if you're doing the same business model, it's a very fast way to find winning products. Let's take a look on the next two sellers that left. Just give you another example before we finish in this video. So this seller, this Israeli seller here, have $10,000 in sales. This is amazing. He have 380 active listings, 171 sell through rate. He's a very good seller, right? And what we want to see now, if we can find product that fits our criteria. So again, I will switch to seven day, hit the search button, and I'll see if there are some products like this. And we can definitely see that we have interesting products here. This product here sell for $9.99, for $9.90, sorry, sold five times in the last seven days and have seven competitors. The rest of his products have a lot of competition. This product here, three sales, zero competitors. This kind of products I really like. And then I go, I click the item finder and I do the same process. And you can even use the filters. You can say, you know what? I know what I'm looking for. So I want product with minimum two sales in seven days and hit the filter button. And then you see all the product that have minimum uh, of two sales. And there is a lot of products here. All you need to do is just filter by competition and list the right products. And the last example I want to show you is on this US seller. This US seller is very interesting as you can see. Uh, also very good revenue, $10,000 in sales, 51% sell through rate. But when scrolling down, we can see that he's focused on specific niche. This seller drops you from AliExpress to eBay, but focus on the man watch only. And he's kind of make all his pictures similar. So he create his brand identity in a way and increase this way conversion rate. So you can use competitor research tool, not just to find winning products, but also learn your competitor strategies, get new ideas on how you can optimize listings, on how you can build your store, and of course, find winning and profitable products. Guys, I hope you find this video valuable. Remember the contest, comment below participate, you can win one month for free. If you find this video valuable, please smash the like button, subscribe to the channel, and if you wanna get notified, don't forget to ring the notification bell. Thank you so much, and I'll see you on the next video.